Hey, listen, listen, she's, she's been through a lot. Can we just... Let me worry about easy? how no, I'm gonna... No, listen to me, okay? Seriously, don't work her like you do everyone else. Don't tell me how to run my camp. You want to move here? You want to help us run this? Then maybe you get some say. <laughs> don't get soft on me, Dee. Deacon? Hey, what? what's going on? What else can I do for you? Thanks. Can I get anything else for you? Get back to work. Hey, back to work. Hey, no, 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 don't. Uh, I'm getting to work. <clears throat> Find me if you need anything else. Okay. Yeah. You here for your bike? Hey, what's going on? I got you covered. Check back. See you around. Just a sec. Oh. How's life in the shit? What's Wait, new? Got a few years here. Last time I saw Boozer was a few weeks ago. He's still around. Yeah. Mm-hmm. See you soon. Okay. You're gonna die out here. I know of a camp where it's safe. Camp? Yeah, yeah. Where? Uh, sh show me. Where? I I'll go. I'll go. Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Oh, man, I... I was done for. Holy shit. You know? Thank you so much. Oh, man. Tell him it was St. John, Deacon. 
They know who I am. Stay off the main roads. Don't stop. <laughs> chopper without being seen and give him hell brother remember what jack used to say don't ride faster than your guardian angel can fly that guy sang jack used to say a lot of stupid shit you can out Hey, Tucker. Okay, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon. Hey, Tucker. Okay, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon out. That should be it. Infestations. Ow. I'll come back later. Finish burning out these nests. So, you want to learn how to hunt? Is that what I'm hearing? I know how to shoot a gun. It's a rifle, not a gun. I was in the 10th Mountain Cope. Don't give me any Marine Corps bullshit. Killing a buck's a little different than killing a man. Or a freak. The best way to hunt an animal is to track it. You gotta focus. 
and see what nature's trying to tell you. If you look hard enough, you'll see the signs. See this pile of deer scat? It's fresh. Yeah, I see it. They lead this way. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Well, come on, man. <laughs> Quick, there's your buck. I see him. Now here. Use my rifle. If you were in the 10th mountain, you know how to use a scope. Yeah, Cope, I know how to use a scope. Easy, easy. I got this. Got him. Nice shot. Oh, God damn it! it wasn't a kill shot. He got away. No, no, that's okay. You wounded him. He'll bleed out soon enough. You just gotta track him. Okay. See the blood spots? Look close. Yeah, I see him. And follow him. On it. He'll be slowing down about now. We should be coming across his carcass any time now. Okay, you know how to... Yeah, look. Cope, Boozer and I have been hunting before. He used to go elk hunting with his old man, and yeah, he, uh, he showed me how to gut it, dear. Well, let's just say no disrespect to Boozer, but you've got a lot to learn. You're wasting a lot of meat there. Overall, not bad. For a beginner. Yeah, thanks. Now... I'll take back that rifle. Here, thanks. Like I said, Deke, we can always use more venison at the camp. Still got some folks trying to heal up from that Ripper attack. Okay, Cope. Yeah, I'll see if I can remember that. says you've been helping out around the camp. I'm gonna say it, but he appreciates it. Manny, I'm still not happy with you. Oh yeah, that's a good piece. This should last you for a while. Good choice, man. Good choice.
I'll wrap that up for you. Cool. Need anything else? Oh, yeah, that's a good piece. I'll be here. Yeah? You got something to say about it? Hey. Hey. What? Not enough credits? See ya. That's it. Hey. Hey, Manny. Uh, hold on, I'll get it. I'll be here. I'll be here if you need me. How's it going, booze man? I'm fine, goddammit. Hey, Deke, we're getting low on supplies. Could use some more meat if you get a chance. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, I guess it's been a while since we did any hunting. I'll see if I can scare up some meat while I'm out. Yeah, I had Cope give me a few pointers, believe it or not. Cope? Shit, don't believe it. Thanks, Deke. See you, Bruce, man. See you, booze man. All right, now I just gotta find some meat. Uh, deer, bear, wolf, uh, fuck, don't matter to me. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. I grew up in this here woods. My grandfather taught me all about hunting. Funny how it still works in a world he never would have dreamed of. I built my first tree house to use as a deer blind. Getting high on the target helps your aim and keeps you safe. Back then, I took out my first doe from up top. Today, my camp's up in the trees. You want to survive and can contribute, you come to me. We got you covered. Grandfather also taught me to catch a doe. Sometimes you gotta lay an ambush. Hide where they need to go. Like a watering hole. Today, you're as likely to be prey as hunter. So you gotta keep your eyes peeled when you're hitting up places we all need to go. My grandfather always said the easiest way to... Stop right now! 
We can be friends now, can't we? Son of a bitch, at least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. Now, what did that been something? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Do what you want. Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that uh, if conducting operations in quarantine zones, that if I encounter any civilians or some... So, Civilians that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next it's night, with Nero Protocol 2 7 were states. I, Everyone was dead. Two they were slaughtered, seven. torn limb Nero for goddamn limb. Protocol All right, listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. I crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So, what's it going to be, O'Brien? <laughs> Yes? Okay? Okay? You remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper, she was wounded. Yes. I remember. A, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead, so I'm gonna ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Like you said, the camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but... I'll check. Uh huh. And I'm gonna go with you. No, you, you can't. Please, you don't. Hey, don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look. If you're gonna fucking kill me, do it. Okay. I did my job. 
Did the woman your wife? I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life! O'Brien, <gasps> report. I have to go. Please, uh, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you, I don't care how long it takes. I'm going to track you down. And I'm going to do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. Man, um, a few days ago, I asked you if you remember that Nero asshole, O'Brien. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of a blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye, booze, man. I'll tell you about it later. When are we riding out of here, Deke? <laughs> soon, loser. Real soon. Look, <clears throat> as soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. This is it. Wait, no, not this way. O'Brien. You out there? O'Brien! Oh, you son of a bitch, you better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I know you're on this channel. God damn it. Okay, you better get back to me or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Oh, God damn it. Oh, come on! O'Brien! Get back to me. Okay, let's take a look around. No, not this way.
Okay, just gotta get this back to Boozer. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Broke another goddamn razor this morning. In our supposed global utopia, Instead of getting the best products from around the world, we got the shittiest products cheap foreign labor could churn out. Everything in the last 50 years was built to break, so that you could buy once, buy again, buy, buy, buy. You always had to get the new car, the new phone, the new this and that, all to feed the beast of crass commercialism. You want something built to last? You couldn't go overseas. stand the test of time. And the same hands that built this country, they'll withstand anything this new world throws at us. Our roads bend, friends, but they do not break. And neither will we. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. They look pretty broken to me, Cope, but hey, whatever you say. Eh, nothing wrong with a little crass commercialism. I mean, I could use a... New bike right about now. How's it going? I've been out a while. Hey, yeah. Hey, booze man. I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Hey, Deke, thanks, man. I'm not real hungry right now. I'll salt it up in a bit.
take down the chopper. Was it the same guy that was on with that night? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. Did he remember us? Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He, he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened. No. No, look, I'm not stupid. I just want to find out, you know, what happened to her. I don't need to find any peace. I, I gotta go, alright? Deacon out. Should stop for fuel. 